what's up everyone you're welcome to come slide tv and if this is your first time then a carbo yes i had to say it in yoruba a nigerian language because no i will explain to you why i said it in yoruba in a bit so come let me tell you why i i had to say it in yoruba not in Ghanaian language that aquaba but a carbo let's go Yeah, what's up everyone when i started i greeted you a carbo and i told you when i get inside you will know why i said a carbo usually i say aquaba aquaba in ghana means welcome and i said a carbo and it's in yoruba it means welcome as well because yes. i'm in the home of a nigerian so i had to greet that way or had to welcome you guys like that so yeah i'm here and here what we do here is this is african port restaurant and it's food they do over here I saw it through Arab World Entertainment. I decided to reach out to them because, I mean, this is Africa, and you guys know I interview Africans, everything, anything African in Qatar, I do. So I had to reach out to them. So I'm here with them. I just need to know stuff. So let me ask the man himself behind this what they do. Good evening, sir. Yeah, good evening. How are you doing? I'm fine, thank you. Yeah, my name is Kamaslai. Kamaslai TV. I push Africans and African products over here. I interview a lot of Africans. So when I saw your thing with Arab world and world around and I said, let me reach out to you and know. So I know you guys do food, African pot. I can see all the food and yeah, stuff. Yeah. I want to know why you decided to do this in Qatar. Thank you very much. And uh, I really appreciate you bringing us on your platform yeah. to showcase our product and what we do to the world. Yeah. It's a great pleasure. Thank you. Uh, I came to Qatar in 2011. Mm -hmm. And uh, the first thing I noticed when I came was that mm. there is no place for Africans to meet, to eat African food. Yeah. And you know, traditionally, every African, anywhere we go in the world, we love to sit down and eat our food. Sure. And we know what it takes to get African foodstuffs yeah. to where we are, yeah. especially for us in the diaspora. Yeah. So I have been nursing that dream to have a place where Africans can come okay. after their day job to relax, yeah. order for African food as if they are back home in Africa eat and then meet other Africans and lovers of Africa okay. in a serene atmosphere. Yeah. So it has been in my mind and I conceptualize it, I dream about it and 10 years after, mm -hmm. this is the dream, African Pot Restaurant. And, and then, it came at a time where we are hosting the whole world for the World Cup. Yeah. It's the one thing I noticed when I entered here is the place looked like I was in Okay, I've not been to most African countries, but it looked like I was in Ghana or and Ghana looks like any other African country. It yes, looks like yes. because when you see the ambience, the environment, everything serene, just like a place in Africa. Yeah. So um, I don't know. You de you deliberately chose here because of the ambience or what? Like the environment. Exactly. When I first came here, mm -hmm. I saw the, the deco. Mm -hmm. I saw the the the, the, the fishes. Mm -hmm. Yeah. the aquarium yeah i saw all the touches it has that african feel yeah i felt at home and i knew intuitively that mm. any african that comes in here mm -hmm. will feel at home and that's 
blew my mind. And you, you are not, you are not wrong. Thank you. This is right. <laughs> you got everything one hundred percent. So thank you. Um, what kind of African food do you have? Is it your Nigeria? Is it only Nigerian food you you sell over here? No, no. Okay. We sell every african food okay in ghana we sell banku okay we sell donkunu i know you're a ghanaian and i know you go crazy hearing yeah, about yeah, that yeah, yeah. <laughs> in nigeria mm -hmm. we have amala mm -hmm. we have eba mm -hmm. we have pando okay we have the world renowned nigerian jollof fry. better than ghana <laughs> <laughs> okay, no, let's that. let's agree so that they will not block this interview. <laughs> oh no, block it! Oh yeah. In, in East Africa, yeah. we have matoke, okay. we have mukimo, we yeah. have ugali. Very good. We have a lot of variety of food, and we on each African food, mm -hmm. we have people from that country okay. that produce in kenya we have kenyan staffs okay uganda we have kenyan chefs okay in nigeria we have nigerian chefs in ghana we have it so that they will cook it the way it is cooked oh, back home i mean even in most of african restaurants they don't even put these measures in place like yeah we have to nigeria cook. to cook energy yeah food yeah and putting all these people in place like coming from their home to prepare their food yeah and yeah to make it like i've tasted the nigerian jollof rice yeah already mm -hmm. and it's good Thank even you. though it's not complete <laughs> i know you say ghana okay. no, but, but it's perfect it's Thank a nice you. jollof and i think i like it and i know everybody else is going to like it exactly Thank think, you. so what i like what are you telling um the Ghan uh, ghanaian nigeria uganda Kenya? like i mean all the african here what are you telling them about the place i want you to tell okay. them something about what it. i'm telling you about these places hmm. get yourself here mm -hmm. come and have a taste mm -hmm. because our logo is the taste of africa okay not the taste of nigeria not the taste of uganda yeah. kenya tanzania zimbabwe ethiopia ghana no the taste of africa yeah. we have africa mm -hmm. in a place in a single place where yeah. you can come feel at home mm -hmm. relax eat uh, whatever food of african origin you want yeah. eat relax conduct your meeting you have birthday party you have get together we have halls where we let out for people to meet okay. so it's a place where africans can meet and feel free I to enjoy the i saw your your rooftop also yeah and it looked very serene like the place looked very thank beautiful you. thank like, you what do you intend doing at that what do they do over there at the rooftop yeah what we do basically is when people have a bad day get mm -hmm. to be like you sit downstairs here yeah people sit down to eat here yeah. But upstairs, you can go there and have a birthday party. You feel free, okay. you relax, mm -hmm. and uh, you know because it's, it's, a, it's a rooftop with uh, fresh air coming, yeah. you can you can come with your friends, okay. with your family, and relax there. So it's a place that is different from here. Here, it basically, is where you sit down and eat. Yeah. But you have a get together, a party, 20, yeah. 30, 50 people. You can meet upstairs. So at the rooftop. I mean, in the evening, that place would look very well. Oh, it's wonderful because, because we have we have a stand for barbecue. I saw, I saw it. Barbecue, asu, whatever, uh, nyamachoma. There's a place there. So as you are sitting down, relaxing, you just go, hey, please give me some nyamachoma. You see? Hey, please give me some suya. You know, <laughs> this is very nice. I <laughs> will entreat everyone to come here. African Port Restaurant. Thank you. So, much. so I want you to give them the direction, like if they are coming here, okay. what they should look out for, building number, street name, yeah. and all those yeah. things, so yeah. that they can come. Yeah. One one more thing is that apart from selling African food at mm -hmm. African Port Restaurant, yeah. we also have a sister company okay. which is called Revitos Grocery and Supply, okay. which is the banner is over there. Okay. We sell African food stuffs. Okay. If you are the kind of person that cook mm -hmm. at home, yeah. you come and get your food stuff, take it home and cook. Okay. So we have a whole lot of options. Most of the food stuff you miss back home, wow. we have it, we sell it to you, you go home and cook it. If you are a good cook, do you so know cassava do? We have everything. You have everything? Yes. I'm going to cook banku <laughs> tonight. I'm so buying cassava. It do. is easy for you to locate us here. Come to Al Hilal uh, Government Services Complex. Okay. Behind it, okay. there is a Doha Atma supermarket. Okay. And when you come, you see Canadian apartment, very popular. Okay. So for now, this is where we are. Okay. Yeah. We have our permanent place where we'll be moving out to. But for now, on a temporary basis, this is where you can meet us. Okay. Okay. You had a location, um, and you guys should come here. Like, come here your your off days when you're not, I mean, working. Come here, enjoy, feel yourself, enjoy the it, look. How, your food stuff are they expensive? No, 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 no. They are they are <clears throat> they are well uh, affordable. Okay. But we all know what it costs to bring food stuff from Africa yeah, over yeah. here in they Qatar. Know. The logistics, I the mean, custom clearance yeah. and everything yeah. but still we make it affordable for people so 
So please, whatever you want, if you come, it's still affordable. It affordable. Okay, Thank that's it. Brother. That's the best, and Thank I and you. I know my people will be trooping in here to come. Thank you. I, I'm hoping very soon this place will be booming. Like, Amen. You, Amen. You 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 will be like. I can't control the crowd. I mean, you know, Africans, they like their food because they, they've eaten this biryani and other things yeah, for a very long time. Those, they are not nutrition for an African. Yeah. An African need to eat an African food to oh, make yeah. him stronger because oh, yeah. we are strong. Oh, yeah. So we need African food to be stronger. <laughs> so, yeah, this is what I want to ask. I'll go around and take videos and pictures of the food Thank stuff you. and things to show them to know. Yeah. I'm not just talking, but you should check around thank you yeah the videos will do the talking for me thank you thank very you very much, thank for, you so much for pushing this agenda thank you and the world cup is coming yeah anybody that's coming we are ready to, the to host the world yes the whole world we, we are ready come here if you're an african you are yeah. coming five african countries are coming and your food mm. is here is here we are going to be your number one producer of your food any country you are coming from these five yeah. countries we have your food over here thank so you very just much come here see you nigeria is not here thank i think you. we'll be supporting this ghana we of course we support <laughs> but don't disgrace us we're not disgrace <laughs> Thank you very much. Thank you. God bless you. God bless One you. love. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. yeah. Thank, you. Thank you. Thank you. All right. Peace. Barbecue party over here will not be bad. Yeah, the barbecue, barbecue party, the barbecue party, and then we can make something very special here. Yeah. Like um, something like. So what do you have to say? 
No, the, the place is a, it's an amazing place actually. It's a very amazing place. African Port is one of the places that you guys have to look at. It's one of the best places. I can recommend any African to come. Okay. Not just about the food, it's mm -hmm. also about like you know the atmosphere, yeah. you know, and then you know the place looks really African. Okay. Really African. So Guys, you better be here. You better be here. You better be here. And sometimes, please come with your wife. Don't come alone. <laughs> come alone. You are teasing me. We those who don't have wives. <laughs> Thank you. 